This is what set off North Korea, U.S. and South Korean military exercises. They happen every year. They always upset the North, which sees them as preparations for an invasion. President Trump had scaled back the exercises. Kim Jong-un is now showing his displeasure. First with a small step, firing two cruise missiles into the sea over the weekend. No restrictions on that. President Biden shrugged it off. No, according to the Defense Department, it's business as usual. So Kim Jong-un escalated, overnight launching two larger ballistic missiles into the water. Under sanctions, North Korea is banned from using those. It's a far cry from the chummy relations between President Trump and the North Korean strongman. Trump even made an impromptu visit to North Korea. A lot of progress has been made. A lot of friendships have been made. Those cozy relations did calm things down at times. But U.S. intelligence officials say they did not stop North Korea from advancing its weapons program. And when talks failed between Kim Jong-un and President Trump at a summit in Vietnam, North Korea fired missiles then, too. Yeah, uh, Richard, you mentioned that President Biden sort of shrugged off that last missile. Uh, do you, does anyone think that this is kind of North Korea flexing its muscle and pushing back? Uh, North Korea is absolutely flexing its muscle. The Biden administration is in the final stages of creating a new North Korea policy. And I think Kim Jong-un is trying to show that it has power, that it does not want to be pushed around. The North Korean leader's sister is also playing an increasingly prominent role there. And she's been taking a hard line saying that the U.S. should not cause a stink in the region. And this tension comes just four months before the Olympics are held in Asia. In Japan. Yeah, something we've got our eye on. All right, Richard, thank you. And again, we do expect the president will be asked questions about this during his news conference later today. And NBC News will bring you live coverage. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.